Steve's Club started all. I had this vision of bringing CrossFit, just sharing it with the kids of Camden, getting them off the street, and it really just grew from there. started Steve's Club Camden first and then from there he added CrossFit Tribe so he had that space and then kind of about the same time he started selling paleo kits. I originally started making the first paleo kit my wife and I in our kitchen. I mean it was really just one paleo kit beef jerky nuts and berries in a bag. One day he decided hey you know maybe I should put this on the internet it'd be pretty cool as a Girl Scout cookie model raise some money for a club. And that started to grow and gain traction so that became a bigger business. We started adding new products, and then the national program started in 2010. The philosophy of Steve's Pally Goods is very simple, to make delicious, clean food. In turn, we're able to give back to the Steve's Club national program and to bring fitness, mentorship, and CrossFit to kids from inner cities, kids that they can't afford CrossFit, but they can greatly benefit from it. I think also CrossFitters like this idea of giving back. So in yeah. thinking about CrossFit and Paleo as a gift, the idea of giving this gift to kids that might not otherwise have access to it. I honestly don't know how Steve does it. Being around him and the Steve's original team has really taught me a lot about hard work and about passion because I really think what it comes down to is when you're extremely passionate about what you're doing, it's not work and you continue to get these things done and accomplished you know, on, on quick timelines because you care. I think that's what it is with Steve. I think he just cares so deeply about what he's doing. Working with Steve's Club National Program, uh, seeing him as a coach with Steve's Club Camden, seeing him as a coach for CrossFit Tribe, seeing him in working every day with the Paleo Kit, Steve's Paleo Goods business. He puts programs in place. He brings in the right people. He's the boss. He is the boss man. But at the same time, he will get his hands dirty with everyone else. And so that definitely pushes everyone to work harder. Coming here makes me a better person. Being around these people, being around Steve, being around these kids. He's always behind every single person that works here. I mean, a lot of times we're having conversations via Facebook about the kids at 11 o'clock at night. It never really stops. So you need somebody like him who's just laid back. Focus, but laid back. You know, and when it's time to get down to business sometimes, you know. He got to lay down the hammer, but that's good too. We have some amazing people that help make the Steve's original team what it is. It's not about objectives or goals. It's about an organic family. Everybody believes in what we're doing. I mean, I think that's the most important thing. Everybody is a strong believer, passionate about not only providing healthy food um, to help people eat better on the go, um, but it also goes towards a great cause. So the food that we sell, that we package up, that we put it so much sweat and hard work into, it's going to help build the Steve's Club National Program and it's going to help make people healthier and fitter.